mimi nataka nimwambie rafiki yetu kwa sababu anasema tuliahidi wa Kenya nafasi milioni moja ya kazi anauliza ziko wapi mimi nataka nimwambie bwana kitendawili nafasi ya kazi ambayo tulikuwa tutengeneze wakati tulisema tutajenga nyumba elfu tano kila mwaka tungetengeneza nafasi ya kazi kwa vijana zaidi ya milioni tatu. lakini kwa sababu nyinyi mumekuja mukabadilisha priorities ya serikali yetu na mukakuja mukasema ya kwamba mambo ya big four mahali nafasi za vijana nafasi ya kufanya kazi zaidi ya milioni moja zingepatikana mukasema hiyo sio priority mukatuambia ingine inaitwa kubadilisha katiba ambaye italete nafasi moja ya prime minister na ingine sijui ngapi ya wabunge ndio priority hiyo ndio sababu ile nafasi haijapatikana ya nafasi ya kazi kwa vijana mukimaliza hii kazi ya kubadilisha katiba na tafadhali tunaomba muharakishe ndio tuweze kurudi katika ile big four ambaye ingetoa nafasi zaidi ya milioni tatu kwa vijana wa Kenya so you cannot come and lecture us about why things have not have happened why we have not created the 2 million jobs we have promised to create when you are the one who has brought confusion you have come with alternative priorities that have put on hold everything we wanted to do under the big four you have even told us that the big four is not a priority that changing the constitution is a priority we want you to understand that the jubilee administration decided on clear priorities unfortunately we have been occupied with the changing of the constitution to create a few jobs and a few positions for the big boys at the expense of creating the millions of jobs for ordinary citizens because of the change of priorities occasioned and the confusion brought about by the people who came from the other side who are ungrateful and today they are trying to lecture us we want to tell them friends we welcome you please have some manners